Not long ago, we learned from our brother Ferdinand, bishop at Rubicon, and representative of the faithful, who are residents of the Canary Islands, and from messengers sent by them to the Apostolic See, and from other trustworthy informers, the following facts. In the said islands, some called Lanzarote, and other nearby islands, the inhabitants, imitating the natural law alone, and not having known previously any sect of apostates or heretics, have a short time since been led into the Orthodox Catholic faith with the aid of God's mercy. Nevertheless, with the passage of time, it has happened that in some of the said islands, because of a lack of suitable governors and defenders to direct those who live there to a proper observance of the faith in things spiritual and temporal, and to protect valiantly their property and goods, some Christians, we speak of this with sorrow, with fictitious reasoning, and seizing an opportunity, have approached said islands by ship, and with armed forces taken captive, and even carried off to lands overseas very many persons of both sexes taking advantage of their simplicity. Wherefore we, to whom it pertains, especially in respect to the aforesaid matters, to rebuke each sinner about his sin, and not wishing to pass by dissimulating and desiring, as is expected from the pastoral office we hold, as far as possible, to provide salutarily with a holy and fatherly concern for the sufferings of the inhabitants, Beseech the Lord, and exhort, through the sprinkling of the blood of Jesus Christ, shed for their sins, one and all, temporal princes, lords, captains, armed men, barons, soldiers, nobles, communities, and all others of every kind among the Christian faithful of whatever state, great or condition, that they themselves desist from the aforementioned deeds, cause those subject to them to desist from them, and restrain them rigorously. Pope Eugene IV